what it do you too slash patreon slash bit shoot today's video i want to turn it with a quick impromptu video in today's video i want to talk about how the media multi-ethnic destruction in america how they uh basically just use the dave Chappelle attack as a distraction and as a double whammy to go back and pick at will smith right so if you don't know this all stems back this all stemmed back a long time ago but the most recent it stems back is to when will smith slapped chris rock on stage a lot of people think it's staged a lot of people don't think it's staged like i said me personally I, i'm 50 50. i think you know they caught will at a bad time i really believe that and at the same time i believe they'll play it all at the last minute type shit, you know what i mean so it's like so it's like i'm 50 50 with it you know but it's hollywood and these are multi-million dollar successful actors actresses the place where they do all of the special effects hollywood you see what i'm saying which comes from the Hollywood tree, the magic tree, the tree of illusions. Go do your research. This this is public info, but um, but yeah. So I'm fifty fifty with that. But this is how these elites, aka secret societies, this is how they start blemishing your image and start attacking your character. So before they assassinate one of their victims, they humiliate them. But they don't always get a successful assassination attempt. Most of the time they do is if the person is kind of like. I don't want to say dumbed down, but not as aware as the next individual. You see what I'm saying? Or well, they got like good handlers and all that type of bullshit. You see what I'm saying? Like. You know, uh, like different things of that nature, like good handlers and you know, like good team set up around them, motherfucker. You know, where they make these type of plays. But anyway, they already been coming after Will Smith for a long time. They already been coming after him for a long time. Will Smith from West Philadelphia, West Philly. Don't play no games. Rough background. You know what I'm saying? Tough upbringing. You know what I'm saying? Very charismatic, respectable individual, you know what I mean, who has done some questionable things. But hey, we all have done some questionable things, right? You see what I'm saying? But hey, I don't mean in the same way, you know what I mean? Everybody's different. Just to put that out there, that's it. <laughs> Just to put that out there for somebody that might try to, you know what I mean, on some dumb shit. But anyway, you know, they already been coming at the Will Smith. Because, yeah, he, he's successful and all that shit. But he doing movies with people like Martin Lawrence. Martin Lawrence is another very successful comedian from Washington, D.C., if I'm not mistaken. One of my favorite actors, you know what I'm saying? They've been coming after him. So when you got these people that, that come from these type of backgrounds that really wasn't supposed to make it in Hollywood or make it to that level, and I don't know hate shit or nothing like that, but you know it's like that. You know how you got the 99% and you got a few people, a very few people that actually can make it out those situations and things of that nature. You see what I'm saying? It's one of those things. You know, um, just like D-Rose, he was that 1% of shit that made it into the league, especially how he made it into the league and shit like that. He went, you know what I'm saying? An average motherfucker wouldn't or wasn't even supposed to make it, but he did. He broke through that, that veil to show you that it's possible. But anyway... These elite motherfuckers been coming at the Will Smith. They want to break him. They want his uh, movie catalog and shit like that. I'm not sure if he owns his movie catalog, however that shit go, whatever. But still, you know what I mean? Like, they fucking with him. They been fucking with his image, with the August Alcina shit, with the Jada shit, all this shit back then. You know what I'm saying? You know, his kids talking shit to him. You know, they making him kiss Jaden in the mouth. All that shit. Well, all that shit is coming from higher up shit. I'm trying to tell you. Humiliation shit. You know what I'm saying? But Will Smith 
you know, that shit fucking with him. So he slapped the shit out of Chris Rock bitch ass that day. You see what I mean? And then now it's like they trying to they trying to keep poking at him. So they use this Dave Chappelle shit. And don't get me wrong, they bank coming out of Dave Chappelle too. I'm not really a fan of Dave Chappelle, like comedy wise and shit like that. He he okay. You know what I mean? Like some I, I you know what I mean? Like I'm like my favorite comedians and shit. Like Will Smith is a comedian too. Like I like Will Smith, um, Mike Epps, Cat Williams, you see what I'm saying? Like you know, Ice Cube, like motherfuckers around like that type of comedy, you know what I'm saying? Like DJ Pooh, like different, like you know, motherfuckers like that. Uh, what's his name? Chris Tucker, you know what I'm saying? Like shit like that. Jackie Chan, you know, motherfuckers like that. You know what I'm saying? But um, but yeah, like they should feel he decent and shit like that on the comedy side of shit, you know. But they were just, uh, you know, Chris Rock he okay as well, but they using that situation. You you see what I'm saying? To uh keep poking at Will Smith and shit because right now they destroying his image. Right now they fucking with his character and shit because they gonna try to uh, do an assassination attempt on him on him if they haven't even tried yet. And of course they gonna try to carry it out either through Jada or they gonna try to carry it out through excuse me, one of these um you know so called Hollywood peers of his. You know what I mean? Like same thing how they did the same play on Bernie Mac. I'm going to leave that one alone, though. You feel me? But, um, but yeah, you know what time it is. And the same thing. They tried to do the same play on Martin Lawrence, too. But that, that same time, when, um, it was a long time ago. Like, Martin Lawrence and shit. I'm not sure what the situation was, but it was, like, footage of him, like, running in the street with a gun, just screaming and shit, saying, they trying to kill me, they trying to kill me, they trying to kill me. And, yeah, he a comedian and all that shit, but I don't think he'd just be doing that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, man. Like, for no reason. Like, it, it just doesn't make sense. Same thing with the whole slapping situation. Yeah, it's like the actors in Hollywood and all that shit. But you gotta look at it. Will Smith is really from the hood. He really from the ghetto and shit like that. So it's like, he in there, but he kind of not in there because he like his own man type of thing. You, you, you get what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah, he a household name, but he that, 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 that ghetto, that hood mentality never really left Will Smith. He just knows how to, he basically, he just know how to speak well. He know how to articulate himself. He know how to speak professional sense. And if he around people that's from West Philly or from another urban area, you know what I'm saying? You speak to him in a different way. You see what I'm saying? But hell yeah, um, they coming after him. Same thing they did with Cat Williams. They, they fuck with his image for so many years, all them different situations. They kept trying assassination attempts, but... Cat Williams is a fucking beast, and he was in the military, he's smart as fuck, so you see what I'm saying, they can't really get him like that, you know what I mean, because he's just on the next level, you see what I mean, but, um, but yeah, man, like, shit crazy, bro, shit crazy, but if you just peep, that's how they use it, the playbook, like, they do double whammies and shit, like, they like, yeah, they should pay a win, forgot about your bitch ass either, but at the same time, we're going to make a joke about this shit, too. But you pick fun at Will Smith. Like, we ain't done with your ass, either. You, you see what I'm saying? And, and that's how they play the game. You see what I'm saying? That's how they play the game. And they're going to keep bringing the situation up and just keep bringing it up. Because you see how they're like, oh, is that Will Smith? That shit funny as hell. But, yeah, man, that's, 